All right. We started this. I was a mechanic doing nothing but fixing cars. And I was in a church one day, and this preacher was talking about agape love, God's love, unconditional love. And he gave me a definition of love that I had never heard of before. And what he said was to gain pleasure and fulfillment from the promotion and benefit of others. And as soon as he said it, it echoed in my head. And I knew the two scriptures that it was based on in, in the gospel. One, he, God gets pleasure from the prosperity of his people. And two, he created us to fulfill the great love that he had for us. So what does God get out of this deal? He gets pleasure and fulfillment by doing what? By promoting and benefiting me. And it's not because I'm a Christian. He does it to the just and the unjust. It rains on the just and the unjust. He just loves because that's who he is. And I realized that if I could build a business based on this core principle, in essence, I could create a, an agape-powered or a God-powered business. And I went, this is cool. And I started to look to see what, every, what do we want out of life? What is the primary function that everybody wants out of life? One, I'm here for a limited period of time, and I want to have a good time doing it. That's pleasure. I want to have fun. I don't want to work. Toiling is under the curse. Mm -hmm. It's not for me. Mm -hmm. I'm under blessing. I still get to work, but it's fun for me now. I'm not working. I'm playing. Yep. And that's what it's about. Amen. And fulfillment, there's a monetary issue with that. Because if your son or daughter needs help and you want to help them and you don't have the resources, you're not fulfilled. If the mortgage has taken the house, you're not, not fulfilled. fulfilled. That's right. So there is a monetary issue here. But this whole process is sort of like digging for aluminum. You can dig 100 miles deep all across the globe of the, of the world. You will never find a gram of aluminum. Why? Because it's an alloy. It's not a naturally occurring metal. Neither is agape. It doesn't naturally occur. It is a byproduct of the function. What is the function? To promote and benefit other people. So I started taking the questions that I had and I started looking for answers, not for me, but so I could share them with other people. Mm -hmm. As soon as I did, all these things started to flow and the power of God started to flow. And I went, wow, this is intense. I've never seen it. And I had to reprogram my own thinking because I wanted to look for money. How do I make this big? How do I go for more people? How do I get this out there and market it? And God said, stop it. You're looking at this. Deuteronomy says that if you ignore money, it will run you down. <laughs> it yes. will chase after you and overtake yes. you. It also says that if you even look at it in Ecclesiastics or, or um, Proverbs, I'm not sure which one. If you even look at riches, it'll run from you. Why are we trying so, so much time to get it? Mm -hmm. Let it worry about itself. Focus on the job. The job is promoting and benefiting other people. So this whole project is just one big core principle. Amen. Now, what was funny was after he pro spoke this, I went to the pastor after church and I went, where did you hear that? I wanted to read the book. I wanted to get more. And he goes, hear what? And I went, to gain pleasure and fulfillment from the promotion and benefit of others. He goes, John, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never heard that in my life. And I went, you just taught it to me 10 minutes ago. He goes, I'll have to listen to the tape because I've never heard it. Wow. He was talking under the anointing of the yeah. Spirit. And it took me, I just sat chewing on this and eating it. So if I gave you one lesson, that's the function. Promoting and benefiting other people. The byproduct of that function, you get to have a fun life. That's, it. that's life. That's agape. That's God. And that's what it's about. Amen.